Subscribe to the channel, comment, and stay on top of all Knicks news. Should the Knicks trade for a star this offseason or hold on to their assets? The New York Knicks had a successful season by any measure. Expectations were not high going into the season. They were not expected to advance past the play-in tournament. A combination of Jalen Brunson's brilliance, Julius Randle's regular season renaissance, and the development of the young players led to one of the best Knicks seasons in 20-plus years. Their playoff run was different from the last Knicks team to make the playoffs. That team from a couple of seasons ago was a veteran roster of guys on short-term contracts. The current team could stay together for years and years if that is what the front office chooses. The question is, what path should Leon Rose and company choose? It is a very difficult question to answer. There are multiple paths the Knicks can take. They could decide to keep the team together and hope for internal improvement from the young players. Another path New York can take is a trade for a very good veteran player that would remake the team. The Knicks have a ton of assets teams would be interested in, from young players to first-round picks. This type of trade would not wipe them out, it would leave the Knicks with some youngsters and picks remaining. Think of a trade for someone like Zach Levine or OG Anunoby. The New York Knicks should save their assets for a true superstar. The path most fans are waiting for is the all-in trade for a superstar. Every offseason some star is made available through a trade unexpectedly. The rumors right now are of Joel Embiid possibly asking for a trade if James Harden leaves Philly. Leon Rose used to be Embiid's agent so of course those dots will be connected. Jalen Brown of the Celtics is someone I would be eyeing if I were the Knicks. They need that secondary wing creator after Jalen Brunson who could defend and hit the three. Paul George is another option I'm intrigued by and might be more readily available. My hope is the Knicks keep most of their assets for whenever that superstar inevitably asks for a trade. The only way New York is going to win a title is if they get their hands on a top 10 player in the NBA. If they can improve the team and still have enough assets to make that superstar trade that would be the best of both worlds. It promises to be a fascinating offseason for the Knicks. With so many questions and possible pathways, I cannot wait to see the end result. It is an exciting time to be a New York fan, let's hope the front office can find a way to get the team closer to an NBA championship. Subscribe to the channel, comment, and stay on top of all Knicks news.